Hi all, it's JV here again from InfoHut with today's guide on how to try and fix an iPhone that has a black screen but still shows signs of life. So what I mean by that is it's making sounds, it rings, it vibrates, even when you plug it in you can even hear it, it making a vibration or even a sound. So let's get started. Okay, as a repairer, I see this quite often and it is not narrowed down to a specific iPhone model. It affects all of them. And what we need to do is we need to go through a sequence of steps to make sure that, you know, we're doing it the right way. So first of all, for those that have no signs of life and the phone is dead, what I mean by that is that there's no vibration or sound or anything. There's a link in my description below and that's a previous video I've done and I find that will be a lot more helpful for you. Now, let's continue. So first of all, step one is we need to give it the good old hard reset. So now follow this with me and we'll give your phone a hard reset. Okay, so this method works on the iPhone 7, 7 Plus, 8 and 8 Plus. What you need to do is hold down the power and volume button at the same time. Now keep holding them for at least about 10 seconds and then you should get an Apple logo. Okay, hopefully that helped and uh, hopefully that's fixed a problem. For some model phones, uh, when you hold that, that power button in, you actually have to let it go and then hold it in again for five seconds and see how you go. Now, if none of this fixes the actual situation, it's pointing towards a hardware issue. So there's some type of part or, or, or component on your phone that needs replacing. Now that needs to be done by a repairer. It could either be the backlight, it could be a chip that, that, that controls a backlight, it could be the LCD screen itself, it could be caused by damage, it could be caused by a multitude of things. Now obviously it needs to be opened up and, and looked at to diagnose what's going on. It could be something as simple as just replacing the screen, but most importantly, what you need to do is make sure that you check your phone is under warranty. And if it's under warranty, you need to take it to a certified Apple repairer because anyone else that does touch it will void your warranty. So if it's out of warranty, obviously you can probably give it, test your luck and, and go to another repairer, but I can't stress it enough. If someone else opens a phone that's under warranty, you'll void your Apple warranty. And Apple might be able to even assist and uh, fix your problem or even replace your phone if they deem it's a fault that's not yours. So fingers crossed there. Now, I hope this video assisted and by all means, please like, please subscribe and don't forget that I've always got updates, tips and little tricks with your iPhone and of course, the latest technology news. Cheers, thanks.